Everyone and welcome to my studio. Hope you're ready for some fun today. I am again trying the Nautilus pour. I got pretty good results on my last one. Think I'm getting it a little more down as to what I need to do. Got my paint consistency right, got my technique a little better. So we're going to give it another try and this time we're using some really bright cheerful colors. So let's go down to the canvas and I'll show you what we're doing today. Okay, we are going to work on this 14 inch wood round. You will see it's sort of messy because this is try number two on this. Um, the first one was mud. So I have marked my center. I have my strainer and our colors for today are going to be Azo Orange, Artist Loft Neon Pink and Artist Loft Neon Violet. Now I tried this earlier and I had white and the orange and the violet and everything was being overpowered by the white and was just becoming this ucky mud. Um, I also was using the split cup earlier and that was blending the colors too much, which it really shouldn't have been because I'm using a very thick paint, but we're not gonna try that again. I tried something else and it was working so much better that we're gonna give that a try which is doing one color at a time through the strainer. I also have switched which strainer I'm using because for some reason, no matter how hard I tried, no paint was coming out at one section of the strainer. Don't know why, we'll see if it happens again. So I think I'm gonna put just a little blop of orange down in the very center here, just to get our strainer going. Set him down. This turntable has issues, but we're going to try and make it work. All right, so we're going to start and we're going to pour one color at a time. Instead of ring pouring it through a split cup, this time I'm going to just do one color at a time. And I'm still going to turn a little bit as I add, add, add the other colors. So we're going to start with a color, and I'm always going to pour to the center so it sort of pushes this color out and puts this color in its place. And I'm going to turn more to help me stay even here and sort of, sort of encourage the paint to go outwards by spinning. Shadows way too long. You always thought that you were weak, but babe, you're wrong. Yeah, you better step into the light, just give it a try. Think that it's time you let that spark out. You've been hiding in the shadows way too long. Cause you're a work of art
strainer on as long as possible because I want to empty out as much paint as possible from that before I pull it. I'm going to give it a little twist as I pull. Ooh, bubble bubble city. Loving this center though. So gorgeous. So if I can just get this to spin a little bit more, to go over that one, this one edge over here. messing with it. I'm not messing it up. I'm going to check the edges, clean them up a bit. There's a few spots and then I'll bring you down for a closer look. That's gorgeous. Oh, I'm so happy. Okay. And we have the wet results and I am so happy. Look at this center. The violet and the pink and the orange and the swirl around and around and around. Just fabulous. Oh, I'm so happy. I didn't settle for what I had before this, but I wasn't happy with, so I redid it. I still have sort of a funky spot. It's not quite in line with everything else down here, but so much better than the last one. Look at that spiral. Okay, I'm gonna let it dry. We're gonna pray that nothing happens to it and it dries beautiful, and then I'll show you the dried result. Hang in there. Okay, we have the dried results on this, and boy, has it changed. When it was wet, you saw pink, purple, and orange, and now you see sort of yellow, gold, dark orange, and light orange. You don't really see pink. You don't see purple, except for that one little spot in the center. Still sort of looks purple, but everywhere else, the purple dried to this sort of dark orange. Really weird. Let's go around here. Not that I don't like it, because I like it, but I've lost those other colors. The orange blending with those colors sort of created shades of orange, which is sort of weird. But that's that. I hope you enjoyed it. Please give me a thumbs up, leave me a comment, subscribe to my channel, and hit that notification bell for more videos. Thank you so much for watching.